Thursday, January 8th. I'm having a very, very weepy, weepy morning. Good God, I just... Sometimes, you guys, you got to hang on with all you have. Sometimes it seems like you don't have much, but we do. So, started a couple of days ago after I finally got the fire. And then I had a furnace put in. I got my heat, I got my furnace. And I started thinking, because I took it so lightly, you know, but thinking about it, me having that gas leak and carbon monoxide, and guys, it was bad. I could have died. Silently. And punky, too. And so I'm here. <laughs> I don't understand why we can't love each other and accept each other. I and know that we're all continuously changing, all of us. And there is an awakening going on. It's not just me. I mean, I'm like, what is going on with me? Why am I seeing these synchronicities? Why am I understanding better? And it all started from going to that beach every day because they had my punky. I went to that lake mission underneath the sun for 13 or 17 days and I don't know what happened. I was dancing, I was singing, and I was laying there soaking up that sun. And I thought about my liver condition. Billy Rubin premature babies are put under the lights and they thrive and there I was underneath the sun of Lake Michigan and because they had my dog I just kept going every day every day watching that sun rise and sunset and in those days it only rained one day and it was a cold rain oh it rained hard and I said, I have all I need. I took the blanket off the sand and I threw it over my legs while I was in my chair. Put my sarong around my shoulders. I held my sun hat on tight and it rained hard and everybody left the beach. But I knew the sun was going to come out. I knew it. It rained hard and I froze. And it was full blast at me in the front. I still faced the water. It was beautiful. Cold, but it was beautiful. And cleansing. And not a soul on the beach. Lake Michigan. Nobody. And the sun came out, guys. And the most beautiful rainbow. So beautiful. And I knew all's well. I have all that I need. I kept saying that. I kept repeating that. Even though we don't have all we need, do we? But you got to keep repeating that. And then you do have all you need. That's how it works. So this beautiful rainbow came out. And I'm dancing with my little iPad thing and wonderful music my son-in-law put on there and I'm dancing in this wet sand and I jumped in the water I lay on my back looking at that rainbow that was put there for me me it was because I matter 
Don't ever, ever think that you don't matter. It's not true. For the love of God, believe me, you matter. And things change quickly, quickly. Start saying mantras like you have all you need. You attract like-minded individuals. Here I am in this tub. How comforting. Wish I could afford a membership to the YMCA and go swimming every day, I would. So I'm laying in bed this morning, starting to feel a little sorry for myself. It hadn't kicked in yet, but I found a letter I wrote to my ex and a letter I wrote to my children and a book, of course. <laughs> Dated 2013. I was begging my daughter to please let me see my granddaughter. <laughs> the letter to my ex. Why? Why didn't we love each other? <laughs> Why don't we love each other? Oh, I don't want the ex. Oh, that ain't, no. <laughs> it's just, here's what it is. You gotta grieve the past, grieve it, let it go. And it's not easy. That's why you get in a tub of water. Go within. Go quiet. Shh. And hang in there. Hang in there, guys. This life is what you make it. It's your outlook and things will start turning around for you. The universe always provides, always have faith in something, believe in something, stand for something. If you don't stand for something, you'll fall for anything. Be kind. Oh, so I was laying in bed, starting to feel sorry for myself. And I have a therapist appointment on the 20th and they called and said, she's got a cancellation. Cancellation, can you come in in two hours? I said, no, wait a minute, I'll be there. So that's what I'm gonna do. Find somebody to talk to. They're there, they're there people. Reach out, reach out to somebody. And if that somebody happens to be a so-called friend or family member and they don't give a shit. Find somebody else. Reach out and grab a hold of somebody. I'm gonna hug somebody today, probably my therapist. And now I gotta get, relax, calm my vibe. If you are going through an awakening, like a lot of people are, because a lot of people are YouTubing it, know that you're okay. Ask your guides to slow your vibe when things start speeding, speeding, speeding towards you and your understanding and your knowing. And you want to pass it along to every single person. How beautiful this life can be. You want to pass it along. And then you might say, but oh, you're pretty down today. Anita, you're pretty down. Well, I'm giving myself 10 minutes in this tub and I'm going to shut this off. I'm going to enjoy this bath and I'm going to go about my day and gratitude and focus. I hope that you will find peace today. No, you matter, don't you dare give up. That's when things change. Don't give up. Hang in there with all your might. You know that you're loved. Love yourself first. If you don't love yourself, you can't love anybody else, okay? All's well, everybody. For the love of God and whoever you believe in, Peace out. Love and light. You are protected too. Bright light, bright light. Archangel Michael, protect me today. All my doings, all my sayings. Help me to be calm. Thank you.